Hey guys. I'm well, if you ever seen butter uh, cup squash in the store, but you just bypass it because you really not know how to fix it. Well, I'm going to show you a real quick way. Um, I see a lot of people trying to take a knife and cut it, but butternut squash is really, really hard. It's really, really hard. It's harder than um, a watermelon, okay? And um, you can hear it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually put it in a pan of shallow water, and I'm going to bake it in the oven whole, and then I'm going to cut it in half. It's just easier to handle that way instead of trying to cut it beforehand. Um, and so that's what I'm going to do. And uh, I have several, as you can see. And I'm going to show you step by step how I do it. All right, there you have it. I'm going to put the squash. I already have it in water, as you can see. And I'm going to put it in the oven on like mm, 375, 400. depends on how your oven cooks. I'm going to cook it until this is tender to the touch. And then I'm going to take it out, let it cool, haul the seeds out, and then begin to use it to prepare my dish. The um, buttercup squash is done. And so I'm going to show you. You press it. And if you, if it, if there's an indention, if it indents, see how that indented? That lets you know it's done. Oh, yes. So I'm going to let it cool. And then I'm going to come back and cut it open and begin to use it. All right, guys. So I've finished cooking the um, squash and it's done. I actually cut it in half and it was so easy. And I'm getting ready to hull all these seeds out. All right. So I've hulled all the seeds out, um, but I'm going to now hull the meat out of this. Now you can eat it just like this. You can put some salt and pepper on it, garlic powder, onion powder, whatever seasons you want to put your little... Um, vegan butter and you can just pretty much eat it out of the shell because it's already done okay so you can do that that's entirely up to you all right y'all this is what buttercup squash looks like whenever you haul it out and make it like cream potatoes it is so good it tastes just like a sweet potato but it has a little bit of an extra taste to it i can't put my finger on it but it is amazing and of course it's less calories than a sweet potato and this is amazing you gotta try it. There you have it. God has created an amazing day. He has given us a great day. He is allowing us to manage it. So listen guys, manage it well. There you have it. Good morning.